Hi, this is Ms. Todorik from The Cool Classroom. And in this video, I wanna share with you how much we make. So this is mostly for my entrepreneurs or even for some YouTubers out there who wanna get started on YouTube and who don't really know how to or just need the encouragement and the support. We are here to help you and show you the way. All right, so this is the homepage of our channel. In the past, uh, this website, so to give you a little history, um, I used to teach in a computer classroom, hence we had TCC. So if you go to About, you, you can see a little bit of the history. It was formerly known as the computer classroom, and that's where I taught in Dobbsbury. And then we changed it to the cool classroom. And this change happened last year in October when I first started here at Mount Vernon High School. So I've been here right now, it's one year, pretty much a year anniversary this month, and it's been successful. My journey with, uh, if you wanna talk money, as far as we were monetized, the YouTube channel, um, but I was only making like $4 a month. It was like roughly, I remember a student, shout out to this student in my integrated office class, um, begins with the letter O, but uh, I remember in class, he was like, Mr. Doric, you only make $4. And I was like, hey, don't laugh. And I laughed myself because it is uh, funny. It was a lot of hard work posting videos ever since 2021. But this past year, I think I was a little bit more consistent. As you can see every day, I guess on my lunch break, I kind of just record. Uh, I got introduced to like test out, fell in love with that program and a lot of content with test out in the past that used to be a lot of nitro type typing. And then one video has nothing to do with what I, I think a lot of the subscribers, this was the video go. So if you go to our videos, let me show you, it's one of the popular videos. This got us all the subscribers, not really the watch hours, but this was a very popular video. And that was a show I like that's on Netflix. So going back, uh, so it was a journey, I guess you can say. Um, we did start, it was January 1st, 2021. And then we've, we've learned a lot. And my YouTube journey has been uh, an enjoyable one, uh, definitely. And now that we have memberships, so if you could take a look after reading, uh, reaching certain criteria and benchmarks, you can add this tab to your channel. And this, you can keep certain videos exclusive only for your members. Um, I try to keep everything free, but right now we are trying to raise money for cricket machines in the classroom. So I just started some basic memberships and very few videos require um, a membership for you to, to watch. Uh, someone's at my door, but um, so they know. I usually, during lunch, students come, they knock on the door, I don't answer. This is my recording time. Uh, so going back, let's get into the good stuff. We are going to go to the dashboard. And I want to show you, actually, analytics. I'm going to click on the revenue. And then I want to show you more. OK, so here are the videos by views. Actually, I wanted to show you the monthly revenue it's somewhere. Okay, here it is. So you can see, like I said, no, that's not it. Sorry about that. How do I scroll down? Is that it? I want to show you the month over oh, right here. It is. Okay, so this is last October. So notice it was about $4 when my students were making fun of me laughing. And it was funny because like, you know, you work very hard and it's like, hey, but at least it's monetized. So it's good and bad. Um, any small accomplishment is an accomplishment. And I tell all my YouTubers, I remember that day I hit 100 subscribers and it was like a big, very big deal. I think I threw a pizza party for the classroom. But you take small steps and you set small goals along the way and you will definitely reach it. So you notice it goes up January, March, $12. And then a little bit higher, 40, 46. And then until I introduce the memberships, you'll see September, it just skyrocketed. And I didn't think I was actually gonna get anyone to subscribe and be a member of the channel, but I was surprised. It's nice, I hope it continues. 
continues that way. This way we can definitely buy more business books, more cricket machines, the vinyl, the t-shirts. We can start donating and giving back to our community. So um, those are some ideas we have and we'd love to make that happen. So I hope you support us, subscribe. Um, here is our YouTube, our, I'm sorry, your donors choose page. And then you'll see the projects currently I have this entrepreneur project we're focusing on. And this is for that five cricket machines. And they're about $2 each. So it is an expensive, it's like 1500, but I'm confident I'll use my earnings uh, for this past September. That's 350. And um, they have special double days. So I know there's one coming up October 11th. Um, so ask me any questions. If you are a teacher, I'll let you know and give you the heads up on these we teach at, I teach at an equity right here, equity focus school. So a lot of the times they companies, they partner up with donors choose and they give you the double donations. So I know like October 11th is one of those special days. Uh, Sonic is great. There's a bunch of great companies who help out. So this would be practically 750, it'd be half off of this. So I'll do the 350 uh, donation last month's earnings. And then we'll see, maybe we have someone else out there who can chip in, uh, help us out. So that is Donors Choose of all the items. We have Aero Gardens, we're growing apple trees in the classroom right now. Um, visit our website, let me show you our website. I'm gonna try to update this a little bit about me. Uh, student YouTubers, I like to promote, cause I know how that journey is, very hard. Stop that music. Uh, and then, um, actually, let me show you on our home page right here. So if you go to home on the bottom, you'll see Tiana, who I just met. She's a basketball player here. Um, very talented. Please subscribe to her channel. Robert, I put him here because he was my first ever member on this YouTube channel. So thank you, Robert, if you're watching. I appreciate that. And then we have some students who I currently teach, um, a student who passed away in the school I've previously taught at. Uh, this is a student currently here, Ozzy, uh, Toasty Dragon. And like I said, there's a bunch of previous students and they are still creating content. So if you look under, I believe it's under community. No, it's under, hold on. Where are all my... Channels. Okay. Under channels, these are all the channels of all my current students and past students who I support and I subscribe to. So I know he's very talented. Young Diablo with music speaks uh, English and Spanish. So go through, subscribe to all these channels. And then towards the end, you're going to see these are all the members of our YouTube channel. So please support them, subscribe to them. We really thank you. If it wasn't, if it wasn't, if you know, if you didn't join a member, we don't, we wouldn't have the 350 to donate and put towards our cricket machines. So we appreciate your help. I hope you continue to stay a member and any help, uh, Wendy Tudoric at Gmail. You can find my email on the about section right here under links. Um, for business inquiries, just click on view email address. It's right there. And that's pretty much it. Uh, we do have a small store. No one has bought anything just yet, but a lot of these items are in our class PBIS store. We have a classroom, um, where students earn points and they, they don't purchase them. They actually get these items for free, depending on the number of points they've earned throughout the school year. Uh, so the membership please don't, don't be my students. You don't have to worry about becoming a member. Um, and then here are a lot of business posts for the community. So I went out to visit my brother's farm and you'll see some pictures. Um, you'll see the gumball machine. I'm going to post the, the earnings. We have an Excel spreadsheet. This is what the classroom used to look like when we first got here in September, completely looks different. I'm going to update those pictures. And then lastly, we have a couple YouTube shorts. This was this past weekend. I saw it was like a 900 pound pumpkin for $1,700. This was at Metropolitan 
plant and flower exchange in Paramus, New Jersey. Uh, the sunflowers we grew in the classroom last June. This is in my backyard and you can see how beautiful they look. So this was a recent couple weeks ago. I took that picture and then we do fan mail. So these are the, some of the things we get back in the mail. There's our cool gumbo machine. Uh, the students, they have the spreadsheet. We keep track of the sales and so on and so forth. A lot of different companies, visits, a uh, you go, the arrow garden. We're going to do more videos. So kind of go through, I'm trying to get as many companies as possible. And that's pretty much it. So any suggestions, send them my way, email me, support my students. And I hope this helps whatever we can do to help support you and your YouTube journey. We're here. Thanks for watching. Okay, I'm back. I'm going to share my entire screen. It didn't record. So I'm inside. First thing I wanted to show you was inside the analytics with the YouTube. So I clicked on before was the estimated revenue. And then if I go to see more, it has it by video, the views. And then you can see the estimated how much we've made last month and how many subscribers we've gained. This is the last 28 days. You can change this to lifetime. And the notice, like I said, we were making very little and then it increased. Uh, it was, let me show you by months. Where did I go? It was right here. So you see September, it jumped up. Notice August, July, we had $45, May. And then if I were to scroll down, see October. So this is what we were laughing at, the $4 last October. And then it slowly increased and it just skyrocketed, in my opinion, just by adding, adding the memberships tab. And that was all done last month. So we'll see how it goes in October. Uh, one other thing, let me see. So that's it. Um, you can take a look. These are current subscribers. So if you have any suggestions or if you want me to go into detail as far as, you know, the content, we have a lot of videos. You can sort it by publication date. We can show you. Just let me know what you wanted to say, but these are everything that's been published. Um, it's pretty cool because you have analytics. You can see like the live count, you know, how many views the last 48 hours. They really, YouTube's great. It really is. Um, the creator music, the earn tab. Once you have merch, you can just opt in to have include shopping on your website. So these are how different ways you can earn on YouTube, your watch page ads, your shorts, my analytics I, for the shorts, the YouTube shorts are very little, like 13 cents. Uh, memberships, we do great. So last month was 210 with a total of 25 members. So I think currently, I think I counted 30. I think we have 30 members right now and some upgrade, some down, you know, and some leave. They just join for like a month or whatever video they want to see. So this is going to vary. We'll have more details, I guess, in a couple of months we can show you, you know, roughly how the memberships are doing. And then I believe the donors choose. This is the page I showed you. This was all the cricket. So you'll see there's five cricket machines, about $200 each. Um, and then we have other projects. So that was Donors Choose. You could just search my last name, Todoric. You'll see the projects that we kind of, um, are, we fund ourselves through the, the, the money we earn in the classroom or now through the YouTube channel. Uh, we do want to get some gamer chairs as well. And then do some more Aero Garden. I know students like that. I like that myself. And what else? And then our homepage. I don't think I showed you. This was 
Yeah, take a look here. There's a great websites we love. And that's pretty much it. All right, till next time. Thanks for watching. Sorry about that freezing. I didn't feel like re-recording. Um, and that's it. All right, bye.